What's up, people? Welcome to FTD News. My name's Dave Walpole. You're probably wondering, where the heck is Leroy? Well, Leroy is in court. He's in court, he got me to fill in, obviously, because, you know, we're buds. So before we get into this, guys, question of the day. What would you guys change about yourselves? Personally, me, I'd probably get a new nose job. Why? Because this one's really itchy right now. I mm, want to scratch, but you guys will see. Uh-oh. So we got a story about a real-life Ken doll. No, we're not talking about Justin Jedlica. We're talking about a new guy. So 20-year-old Brazilian model by the name of Celesto sent bang. He has spent over $50,000 to make himself look like a real-life, you know, Ken doll. Now, this new guy even says that he even tries to act like a puppet so he can be more like Ken himself. Now, this guy is currently trying to be Ken, looking for his perfect Barbie out there. He actually wrote on his Facebook page, who wants to be my girlfriend? After all, no one is happy alone alone, which I don't know if that's necessarily true. Do you guys agree with that? Maybe you'll just get lucky and it'll score that, you know, Barbie chick, you know, Valeria Ludianova. I could see them totally living in a dollhouse later, you know, talking on their plastic phone and wearing plastic shoes. So right now things are getting crazy on the net. Why? Because people are speaking out about this fisherman who totally made a fish smoke a cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> a video was posted on live leaks showing this fish obviously smoking down and getting cancer. People are making jokes saying that it's like some puffer fish. I don't think it's actually a puffer fish. I think they're just jokes. To be honest, I don't really know. I ain't no marine biologist. Now people online are saying that this is totally disrespectful towards mother nature. But let's be honest, can you really call this animal cruelty? I mean, isn't fishing without a net and a hook, you know, animal cruelty to begin with? Because you're using a hook to catch the thing and it's got a Hurt. But here's the thing, are you guys against animal cruelty? Let me know by hitting that like button. Now, as a matter of fact, for this video, people are wondering where it's actually filmed and who the guilty people are. Unfortunately, there is none of that information and people really don't know who the people are. Now, let's go all the way over to London where some big news has just recently happened. Recently, an Arabic news reporter unveiled herself. Now, she was broadcasting in Arabic from London from her studio called Al Akbaria. Now, this thing has totally caused a whole stir in Saudi Arabia because the Islamic woman obviously reported without, you know, this definitely is sort of a historic thing. But for Leroy's followers, I want to know from you guys, what do you feel about this? Now, in the stories of worldwide records, we got an amputee that has done the most push-ups ever. Corporal Tamir Dadiani, he's 22 years old, and he doesn't have two of his legs. I don't know how many other legs people have. I'm assuming that two is just enough. Now, the guy's from Georgia, and he actually lost his legs from standing on an improvised mine. But he has set the record for most planche push-ups. Now, this is a kind of exercise that's really really difficult and it's not easy. You need a lot of strength. Why? Because it's your arms holding you up mostly. I'm glad to see the people out there who do have physical difficulties and disabilities are really pushing themselves to, you know, set records and obviously do better for themselves. So Corporal kind of got to salute you there. So that's it for FTD News, guys. Now, last question is, if you could be any animal, what would you be? This is what you guys said down there. As for me, I would probably be a giraffe. Why? Because I got a really long neck and I can just smack people around with it. So thanks for watching, guys. My name's Dave Wapple. Real Canadian white mayonnaise eating son of a gun. Okay, I can't even do it as cool as Leroy does. How he does that ending, I don't really know. Anyways, have a good one. Peace out. Home slices. Woo!